What up guys, this is Nova Woman Angel here, and right now I have a small confession. Um, I did actually mess up the recording for uh, this, so this isn't live. By this point, I already beat the game, so, um, but once I start uploading again, um, with Season 4, that's when you're seeing my live reactions, but this is pretty much me replaying this part. Um, a couple differences though from what I actually did the first time. To get here faster, I skipped Bluebeard since we know what he does. So I didn't bother with Bluebeard and um, yeah, so um, I already know what happens with that. So I just decided to skip over that and just go straight to the Tweedles after I do engage in the um, the bar. So let's go ahead and get started and see what's going to happen here. Maybe something different, right? Let's start by checking everything. Um, I don't believe I checked the scales my first time. I didn't say anything. That's interesting. Crooked man. For your collection. What is that? No idea. Pretty sure it's something they aren't supposed to have. This isn't the witch, though. What are you looking for exactly? Maybe I can help. Anything about Crane. Or the witch he was using. Something. Uh, let's see here. I know that the thing is over here, but... Explore for the sake of the episode. Hold for BCW. <laughs> JD. A book. Books doesn't really tell us much. He doesn't even open it. Sorry, I know I'm late. I'll get it to you soon. Ichabod Crane. Who was he sending money to? Crooked man. Care of the lucky pawn. You know what that is? Is that what you needed? I don't think so. But it's interesting. There's more going on here. Still need to find that witch, though. All right, butcher. What is this stuff? Some dreads. All right, and this is the item. Hey, Big B. Do you think? After all this, do you think I could come back to the Woodlands? Since Crane let me go, I mean, I can still work here, but I don't think I want to now. I don't want to work with bad people, you know? You and Snow, you're nice. You should talk to Snow. Maybe there's something she can do for you. Really? That would be... thank you. Hey. It's Snow's hair. Snow White? Why... We found her hair like this inside Lily's glamour. Anti-Greenleaf. This must be the witch Crane was using. I guess Dee and Dumb were getting the hair for Crane and sending it to her? That's not a pleasant thought. <laughs> Anti-Greenleaf? A.G. This is it. Alright. Uh... I have to tell Snow, this is the place! There, there's a phone right over there. Thanks, Fly. Business office? I know who she is. Alright, lads, so now we're going to meet up with Auntie Greenleaf. Alright, someone's at my door, so I'll be back Make in me. a bit. I just got here. Yeah, me too. It's number 23. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, I know. This is it. Alright. How do you want to do this? Um, let's go ahead and, uh... Listen. Hear anything? If anyone's in there, they're being awfully quiet. Hi. You woke me up. 
Hello, little girl. Uh, sorry about that. Is something wrong? I don't think I've ever seen you before. Who are you? Rachel, who are you? Just so we're not strangers. Well, I'm the sheriff, and this is my partner. Boss. Pleased to meet you. How do you do? Is there, um, is there anything you need? I'm not allowed to let people in. Is your mother at home, currently? I don't need a babysitter. I can cook dinner all by myself. <laughs> is there uh, something you want? I don't think I can really help you. Maybe come back in the morning. Rachel, do you mind if I take just a quick peek around? We'll be very quick, and he won't touch anything. Indeed. I've been here all night. Nobody's been here. That hostility, though. Calm down, little girl. I'm gonna trust you not to break anything. Don't get me in trouble. What are we looking for specifically? Don't right. worry. You could still be here. You're the boss. You should be guiding me. Bitch. <laughs> All right. Let's see here, lads. Get a little record player first. Let me guess. Big band or classical? Honky tonk. No accounting for taste. That your mom? Uh huh. No one's been over all night, so... He's just going to check. It'll only take a moment. It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. Burn keys! Dowdy. That's how we like it. Where do you buy your... Your mama hunter? Oh no, she never... That was found in the woods around Dick's Mountain. I think. Da, 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 da. I saw a spider over there yesterday. Oh? It was a pretty one. Cream. Nope. A butcher. What's that? A package having to do with someone called the butcher. I saw one just like it at the Tweedle's office. Not here. There's no one here but me. I Nothing that looks like Crane was here either. Nothing? See? Let's look at that girl and let's look at the picture. Do you have any pets? Not technically. He's <laughs> talking about me. Fucking witches. The tree. What is this? Mommy uses that to carve her trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? Um, like glamours? God damn it. I shouldn't say that. Nothing. I keep getting whiffs of that aftershave of his. I do too. Shut up, bitch. Can I go to bed now, please? Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I tried. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. I don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. Look, I'm already grounded. Just put it back exactly where it was, please. I'm not gonna break it. I just wanna open it. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! You gotta believe me! The guy isn't here, I promise! It's 
gonna be okay, Rachel. Please, I'm begging you. I don't wanna, I don't wanna get in trouble. What a shocker! <laughs> it hurts when you do it that fast. It hurts when I do it fast. What? Not sprightly enough? You think we have time to waste on this shit? You think this is some kind of game? No, I don't. But congratulations on winning it, if that matters to you. All right, start explaining. And from the beginning. I was born in the woods to a jackal and a deer. Not that! None of this pathetic witchcraft crap is gonna prevent me from prying what I need from your gullet. Now tell me where Crane is! I ain't a fortune teller, yeah. wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You have to know something! Unless you want a recipe for owl stew, there's nothing I know that would help. Just why in the name of everything holy are you protecting this weaselly scumbag? I mean... What on earth could he have done to deserve this kind of loyalty? Loyalty? Crane could be hollow bones tomorrow, and you wouldn't see me cry a drop. But that doesn't mean I can tell you anything. You we... have friends, don't you? Well, I don't want Crane's friends for enemies. If you're not protecting Crane, who are you protecting? You're Get this man. through both of your skulls. I can't tell you. Just you being here is bad enough. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Whatever it is, Greenleaf, whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something, you have to forget it. This is more important. <laughs> is it? We can protect you, okay? Whatever it is you're afraid of, we can make sure that it won't come to pass. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap. If she's afraid for her life, we can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! How dare Dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two fables are dead because of this crap. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. Very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but please, don't do this. Isn't there another way? She's a witch. Can't she just work for us? That way she'd be official. You want to reward her for criminal behavior? We can't trust this woman on the 13th floor. It doesn't matter, because I'd never do it. I'm not a house cat, and I don't play well with others. Oh, trust me, no one would confuse you for a cuddly animal. <laughs> Bigby, this is an order. Burn the tree. No! Look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Crane was here. He was here, and he left. He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that will pierce the protection around the girls' speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. Feel! I'm sorry, but we still can't let you keep the tree. It wouldn't be right after what's happened. Big B. Please, Sheriff. Don't. You know, you aren't technically my boss yet, Snow. Do you think this is a joke? No, I don't. The fact is, Cole hasn't confirmed you. Until he does, you have absolutely no authority over me. Bitch. I'm not gonna burn down this tree. All right, let's go. <laughs> hey, Greenleaf. 
don't think this is over. I didn't actually I pick won't. that option last time, but because I totally like did like um I didn't hear that pet technically thing because I got uh, I got through it faster. So she called me her pet. So therefore I fucking put my foot down. <laughs> 